Welcome to your planner. I'd like you to first know that it is 100% customizable. This can range from features like setting yourself a reminder for an appointment for the following day. You just need to let the planner know what day and what time you'd like to be reminded and this will come through your app and also via an email notification. The next part is resetting your cover photo. You can upload a file, you can choose a default, it is entirely up to you. Something to note, if you make a mistake and you want to undo something and the Command Z or undo button doesn't work, in the top right corner where the three dots are, you can click on page history and revert the plan back to its original. You can change the order and style it how you'd like, add blocks, remove blocks. I want this planner to replicate your brain. And what makes this planner the first of its kind is the work lifestyle management coinciding with your health tracker, which we'll get into. As you can see, this is your main dashboard. I wanna to touch base on the daily diary. Right now, an automation is in place that pulls up a new entry every day. The best part is if you go into the pre-made templates, which I'm in right now, you can input recurring meetings or reminders so you don't have to keep writing the same information every week. For example, you need to walk the dog at 7 a.m. every Monday and I'm going to color code it blue because I need to schedule it. Let's go back up to the top. I wanna to show you the shortcuts to your daily entries. I would date each one for your food diary and your symptom tracker so that you can find it easily. So here we are going to pop into your symptom tracker. Just for an example, I've already inputted my data. I can change something here so I can delete the yes and then click the no. I can either press backlink or I can just press the backspace and it will take me back to my Monday template. So here I will show you a new entry. I'm gonna click on it again, input the date. And as I scroll down, I've also got two toggles, my win for today and one thing that I struggled with. Let's go back to our original page. Scroll down and you'll be able to enter your training program. This will also pop up every single day. Here are your supplements. You can remove them or you can add your own. So let's say that you're taking lion's mane every single day. That will now pop up every Monday. If you need to add any more supplements that you are taking, you will find a table here that has a lot of information in regards to the most basic of supplements that most people take. At the bottom of the table, you can add your own. As we go back to the planner, let's remove lion's mane and we can set today's intention. There is a lot of research behind journaling and the effects that it has on our brains the following day. So whether you want to fill this in in the morning or the evening, it's entirely up to you and you can check your tasks off as you go along. There is a lot of psychology behind this, so I hope that you can use this to your full advantage, knowing that this is fully equipping you to set yourself up correctly for the rest of the day. This is your daily planner, which you'll be able to time block anything that's going on. As we already mentioned, like any recurring meetings, you can delete some of the blocks if you'd like to, change the times around. And this is your priority planner, which we'll go into more detail in later. Back up at the top, you won't want to edit this on your template because every day will be different, but I'm just showing you how you can click your main project for the day and your main task. I suggest your templates for your daily diary is the first place you start. 